Hello everyone, right now is Porsche Car Fails Compilation. Guess how many dollars we will lose in this video. Let's get it on. The 2014 event saw a 1973 Porsche 911 RSR IROC, driven by Rito Toscan, lose control and run right into a metal barrier, launching it into the air. Thankfully, the driver was not injured in the crash, but five spectators received minor injuries. <laughs> Driver Harry Kleenian and his co-pilot Bart Den Hardug were taken their 964 Porsche 911 RSR through the course when they came to a right-hand bend and suffered a huge crash. The brakes appeared to lock up and the car went straight into the concrete barrier, sending the 911 through the air and right into the water beside the course. Luckily, both Kleinian and Hardog did not suffer any injuries from the scary accident. Instead of keeping the newly purchased car, the owner rushed straight into the shop window and broke the glass, surprised bystanders and the owner extremely alarmed. Oh, shit. Crazy Porsche 911 Turbo S Cabriolet loses control before crashing into a fire hydrant and flipping itself over. Lose Porsche Boxster Spider crashed into a crowd at Boyce Cars and Coffee. But fortunately, no one was killed and six people were slightly injured. The Porsche Carrera GT is notoriously difficult to drive, especially with its clutch, so driving it at slow speeds onto a trailer using wooden planks is a recipe for disaster. I think the squirrel was so sad when it was hit by the Porsche itself at 100 km per hour and hit the roadway. It seems this man is too confident in his steering, but he was so stupid that he crashed into the car right in front of him and the Porsche 918 probably damaged the front end. At a stoplight, the Porsche Cayman driver smashed the throttle trying to show off only to lose control and go right over the median, causing quite a bit of damage. Instead of pulling over and inspecting the car before even thinking of driving off, the driver kept on trying to save face, only to lose control again. This time, the Cayman slid into the oncoming lanes and lost a wheel. After that, the driver finally wised up and pulled over to the shoulder.
keep you in it. <laughs> they- Not much is known as to what happened with this Porsche 918 Spider that erupted in flames at a fueling station just outside of the Canadian city. But the fact that it was at a gas station lends to the possibility that it could be something other than the vehicle itself that started the blaze. It seemed that the Porsche car behind was eager to pass, but the car in front could not catch up, so there was a collision right at the beginning, and both of them have damaged the front end. The track and the bends always surprise us. With just a small mistake of the red car wanting to overtake, the Porsche 911 climbed to the top of another car. The Porsche GT1 looked like it was accelerating to prepare for a turn when it did a few turns and then fell. It's badly damaged the whole car. I hope the driver is safe. And that's all for today. Wow, we just had a million dollar failure experience. If you enjoyed this, please subscribe to the channel. See you again.